Hello all and welcome to my channel Infosec Geeks. This is Asad Ahmed and today I am going to show you a video on WAF bypassing through SQL injection. So today uh, I am going to bypass a website where uh, a WAF named Mod Security is implemented. Right? So before proceeding further let's let's check what is WAF so a web application firewall WAF is a specific form of application firewall that filters monitors and blocks HTTP traffic to and from a web service by inspecting HTTP traffic, it can prevent attacks exploiting a web application's known vulnerabilities such as SQL injection, cross-site scripting, file inclusion, and improper system configuration. So let's start. Let's start our video. So I'm going to demonstrate again. SQL injection on this website so this is our website now I'm going to start SQL injection on it and proceed to WAF right first step is as, as you can see here page is loading normally as you can see here right next step is putting a single code at the end like this and we have SQL error now again I'm going to check if SQL injection is fixed or not no it's not fixing going back here next step is so I'm going to start order by payload to check the number of columns order by one or nothing still the same error now I'm going to use a SQL comment that is hyphen hyphen check if I can bypass this error hyphen hyphen enter notes <clears throat> again I'm going to try again and removing this single code a post trophy hitting enter and yes the page is loading normally let's proceed to finding the column so starting from 100 right I am checking if number of columns are 100 it says no I am going to check if this site has number of columns 10 it says no again I am going to check number of columns 6 if it, if it has 6 columns says no unknown column further down three knobs on two yes page is loading normally and we found number of columns which are two okay next step is to find the vulnerable columns how many columns that this site is echoing back 
so for this purpose I'm going to use a union select I guess yes union select union select method union select space 1 comma 2 hitting enter and o we encounter we encountered a graph not acceptable this message is generated by mod security graph this is very basic type of graph nowadays in most of uh, web application websites so <clears throat> how to bypass this screen this web let's continue so what I'm going to do I'm my first attempt is to convert the union into this conversion right so I'm going to change it to union to forward slash mm, asterisk where is asterisk asterisk exclamation sign 50,000 and again putting asterisk and forward slash hitting enter and yes we have bypassed the mod security graph right we have is bypassed but still we couldn't find the vulnerable columns that was the first mission so what I'm going to do here I'm putting hyphen before number two like this hitting enter and yes we found a vulnerable column that is 2 as you can see here right let's replace it check the version at the red at the red version version of the database no graph is again blocking us going back let's try version In bracket close small bracket close hitting yes we can see the, now we can see the version of PHP and WAF is again bypassed right checking the database name yes this is the name of the database Let's try to see the username and we found the username of this database. So that's all for this video. I hope you like this video.